is just in. August is hotter than ever at Appalachian Wireless as they are slashing all normal contract pricing on all smartphones by 50% when you sign up for service. Better service, bigger savings. Serving you for the last 25 years at Appalachian Wireless. Voters in Jenkins will soon decide if packaged alcohol sales will be allowed in the city. Letcher County Judge Executive Jim Ward recently issued an executive order placing the issue on the ballot for Jenkins voters. And on September 27th, they'll vote on the matter. The good thing about America is you got the choice and, and, and every now and then you get a vote on something, what you feel like is uh, best for you and your family. So, uh, you know, some people circulated a petition to, to have it put on the ballot and, and people have the choice now to uh, to go and vote for or against it, you know, if they've got uh, beliefs, convictions against it, they they've got opportunity to say no. If uh, if they feel like it'll be an opportunity for maybe some growth or uh, some kind of economic impact, uh, they can vote that way too. The issue was brought about by a citizen's petition, which was verified recently by Letcher Clerk Winston Mead. Jenkins already has a buy the drink ordinance. Mayor Todd DePriest said two retail stores, Dollar General and Rite Aid have expressed their interest in package sales. DePriest said voters will be allowed to have their voices heard. Like I said, there's a lot of personal beliefs, uh, different ways. I don't think it's the the one thing that's going to make everything better. Uh, I, I do believe that, you know, the opportunities to expand, if it draws one more business to town than we had before, that'll be a good thing. Uh, you know, I, I don't believe anybody starts drinking or stops drinking because it's available here, because it's, you know, we're just a few miles in any direction to, to get it anyway. But, you know, again, I respect those that, that, that doesn't want that, and that's, that's what the vote's for. The election will be held at Jenkins High School for all of the city's four precincts. The school will not close for the election. Reporting in Jenkins for EKB News, I'm Chris Anderson.